Leadferret.com and SalesNexus CRM and email marketing have partnered to now allow you to target and reach out to B2B contacts in just six steps in only 15 minutes. And I'm going to show you how to do it right now. First, we're going to create a free Lead Ferret account. Then we're going to create a SalesNexus free trial. Then we're going to target contacts in leadferret.com. We're going to transfer those contacts right into SalesNexus. Then we're going to set up an email in SalesNexus, and we're going to send that email out to those targeted contacts. It's that simple. And you're going to see how right now. The first thing you want to do is go to leadferret.com and create your free account. You click right here where it says create a free account and fill out this short form. And you'll be emailed a confirma confirmation email where you can click a link and your account will be activated. Then you're going to go to salesnexus.com and you're going to click the free trial link right there and you're going to fill out this short form as well as the, the second form on the next page that results. It's a two-step process only take a couple of seconds and you'll be emailed your logon information to your sales nexus free trial then you'll want to log on to lead ferret which I'm gonna do right now and we'll start searching for contacts so in lead ferret you can search for contacts by title by first and last name by their uh, area of specialty you can also search for criteria related to their company, like the company name, the SIC code, their state, their revenue, um, their domain, zip code. You can see there's just a plethora of search options, including geographic. I can put in a zip code and a radius around the center point of that zip code and find companies within that uh, circle, basically. Um, so to make it real simple here, let's say that I'm looking for property managers. Maybe I'm in the landscape business. I do uh, commercial landscaping for buildings and things like that. So I'm looking for property managers in, let's say, Wisconsin. And I could even narrow that down by the number of employees or things like that if I want to target certain size companies. And then I hit search. And now the system is searching through the Lead Ferret database. And you can see here it's come back with a list of contacts. So if I want to grab all of those contacts, I say, target all right here or I can select specific ones to target like that but I'll just say target all so now I've targeted all of those contacts then I'm gonna click on saved searches and you'll see that all your targeted contacts uh, are in the saved searches page and you notice down at the bottom there's a two sales nexus button so I can check them all and then say to sales nexus. And then here you want to put in your sales nexus logon information. So when you sign up for your sales nexus free trial in the logon email that you receive from sales nexus, which you see here, this last little bit of your URL, which comes after the logon.salesnexus.com, everything after that, that's what we call your database ID. You'll want to copy that and then go back to Lead Ferret and paste that database ID in there. Then put in your username and your password and hit go. And the system is now going to begin to transfer those contacts to SalesNexus. 
as soon as I hit start. Before I do that, though, you'll notice that it's going to keep track for you of how many contacts you've transferred. Every single Sales Nexus user has access to 250 lead ferret contacts every month at no charge. So I hit start, and you can see now it's beginning to transfer those contacts into my Sales Nexus database. So as it's transferring, remember that these contacts include the address, mailing address, phone number, title, company name, as well as the email address. And that's all included at no charge when you download them from Lead Ferret into Sales Nexus. So here you go. Here's my results. It's transferred all the contacts successfully. And if you notice at the bottom, it says click here to open your Sales Nexus account in a new tab. So I click that link and it logs me onto my Sales Nexus free trial. And if I click on the contacts tab, there's all the contacts that I just transferred. So we want to send those contacts an email. So what I'm going to do, you may have already downloaded um, contacts into Sales Nexus in your free trial from other sources, etc. So I'm just going to be sure and show you how you can search for from the lookup tab. For if you put in lead source equal to lead ferret, that's looked up specifically the contacts we've brought over from lead ferret. I click on the view icon next to one of those contacts. It makes it my current lookup. And if you notice, if I hover over the little arrows up here in the upper left, it tells me this is one of 27. So I'm working with a list of 27 contacts. Then if I click on the letters tab, that will take me to where my email templates are. And in every new Sales Nexus database, you have what's called my first email. And this is just a very simple, easy email for you to quickly customize and begin to send out. So first, you right-click on it and hit Edit. And another window will pop up with that email. And you can see here, it says Dear, and then there's a mail merge field for the first name. And down at the bottom, Best Regards, and there's a mail merge field for your name. And then all this capitalized text is intended to be removed for you to replace with your copy. So I might, if I'm in the landscape business again and I've downloaded property managers, um, I might want to send them an email something like this. Um, see how to reduce um, property maintenance costs by 15% annually in this free guide. Download here. And then I select that text and I can hyperlink it. And I put in my website address. And now I've got my email. And, of course, you can put in images and so on. In fact, let's go ahead and put a logo in at the top. Right here, if you click the Insert Image button, you can upload a new image, your logo or other product shots and so on, into this list and then select that image and say Insert. And now I've got my logo. So now I've customized my template. I hit save. And my email's ready to go. Okay. So again, we're working with our list of 25 contacts that we targeted and downloaded 
from Lead Fair and into Sales Nexus. Now I'm going to go back to my first email and I'm going to now right click and hit open to open that email for use. And here I want to click current lookup because I want to send this email to everybody in that lookup. Then I'll put in a subject. Actually, let's make a better subject line. Uh, reduce property maintenance costs by 15%. And down here, I can enable the tracking. So that's going to tell Sales Nexus to track who opens and clicks on your email. You can even turn on notifications. So if you want to be notified when someone clicks on that email, then you just check that box there. And then you hit send, and the system's going to warn you, you're going to send this out to 27 people. Do you want to do that? OK. The email, emails have been queued and are on their way out. And that's it. It's that simple to target B2B contacts and reach out to them via email with Lead Ferret and Sales Nexus. Good luck.